100% free giveaway for the Travis Scott Reverse Mocha Air Jordan 1 Lowe's. All you guys need to do is like this video, subscribe to the channel, join the Moore family, and leave a comment down below. Let me know your size in the Reverse Mocha Travis Scott Jordan 1s. Make sure you guys click that subscribe button. We're on the road to 60,000 subscribers. Good luck on winning a pair of Travis Scott Reverse Mochas. Because I'm giving away a pair of Travis Scotts, I'm gonna ask you guys to please take a second to smash that like button down below. Let's see if we can get this video up to 500 likes in the first 24 hours. Smashing that like button really does help the channel grow. Sneakerhead, Soul Premise makes bags for you. These bags hold your sneakers when you're traveling. Right here we have the daily bag. This bag holds two pairs of sneakers. They make a bigger backpack that holds up to five to six pairs. There's actual compartments inside the bag to store your sneakers when you're traveling. You can put your shoes up here and down there as well. There's room for your laptop and tons more. Now in the duffel bag, it's your traditional duffel, but you also have side compartments to store your sneakers as well. There's tons of different bags, tons of different styles, colors. You guys are gonna find a bag that you're gonna fall in love with, with my link down below in the description. So make sure you guys click that link down below in the description, go to Soul Premise, add a bag to your cart, and use the code Danny Moore at checkout for 40% off. Thank you, Soul Premise, for sponsoring today's video. I was wrong. I'm wrong about this pair of Air Jordan 1s skyrocketing in price, going to the moon, being more expensive than they already were. In fact, I'm so wrong that this sneaker actually dropped a lot. And I'm talking hundreds of dollars in price here. This is absolutely crazy, unexpected. I am speechless about this. I cannot believe this happened. Sometimes I'm right, sometimes I'm wrong doing these videos. I am human. I do believe that these videos do help you guys out and give you guys some advice. However, sometimes I'm wrong. You know, sometimes I'm going to be wrong. I am human. I do give you guys advice based on my experiences, what I believe, how I personally feel, what I'm personally doing a lot of the time. Sometimes I realize that, hey, I'm gonna lose some money, but I will make up money in other pairs more than I pretty much expected or what I even expected. Obviously, throughout time, of course, I do make money doing this, but I wanna give you guys my advice my tips and that's what i do throughout these videos sometimes i'm wrong i do give you guys things like i said based on my experiences what i believe but i'm not always right remember that so with that being said i want to show you guys a pair of air jordan ones that at first i was right about at first when they first released i was right on the money i was right there now oh man they've tanked and they've plummeted hard hundreds actually over a thousand dollars. I'm wrong and I'm sorry. I apologize. I'm dead wrong on these, man. I'm sorry. Let's get into this. Let me show you guys these Jordan ones, man. Oh, I'm sorry, man. This sucks. I rented $1,000 Nike off white sneakers. In an upcoming video, I'm gonna show you guys what happened. I rented these from Kicks World, but this video will not be sponsored. So I want to show you guys a little sneak peek at what sneaker I'll be renting. These are crazy fire. So we have Nike swoosh on the box. You guys know the white box as I almost dropped the box there. And inside we have the tissue paper and we have a beautiful pair of off-white sneakers right here. These are the off-white Air Max 90 in the black colorway. Huge shout out over to Kicks World. That's where I rented these from and I'm very excited to use this service and test it out. Not sponsored at all and really show you guys, hey, you can rent sneakers at something new and something different and I'm excited to test these out. A huge shout out over to Kicks World. Stay tuned for that upcoming video dropping very soon. I just have to put these to the test wear them and i'm excited for that man this is gonna be a dope video not sponsored but really putting kicks world to the test i have to apologize i'm sorry for being wrong on this pair of air jordan ones the market man has completely tanked very hard on this pair of air jordan ones it's absolutely crazy I'm sorry. This is a Jordan 1 box, blue and white. You guys know what comes in this box. We do have the ticket, 
which is fire. And I want to talk about this ticket a little bit more. And we have the shoe. I do have the other one up on display still behind me. The trophy room. The Air Jordan 1 trophy room. Oh my goodness. What has happened to the market? I was wrong. I was completely wrong. I thought that these would jump up to three, four thousand dollars. They were at around two thousand before the release. Then the actual drop date came. No pairs were really sold because a lot of them were backdoored. And the market went up. A week later, they went up to over $3,000 in some sizes. However, they didn't stay over $3,000 for long. The market came crushing down slowly and down. As the months went by, prices dropped. These are now sitting in this size 10 and a half at around $1,500, $1,600. Some sizes are at $1,800, $1,900, but most of them are sitting at around that $1,500, $1,600 price point, which is absolutely insane to me. I'm sorry, I was wrong about these. At first, I was right because I did say the market would go up to over three grand, and they did. However, it didn't stay there. Not for long at all, and now, you know, over a year after release, look at the market, guys. Look at the prices. Oh my goodness, it's so sad what happened to the market on the Trophy Room Air Jordan 1. I bring out the Trophy Rooms as well as the ticket because it reminds me a lot of what's dropping very soon, which I cannot wait for. The Air Jordan 1 Chicago Reimagine, or now they're calling it Lost and Found. They're coming with a receipt, not a ticket, but a receipt from like mom and pop stores, which is awesome. It brings it back to 1985. The Air Jordan 1 Chicago, vintage style. These are the Chicago's with glitter effect to it, which is nice. Michael Jordan's signature on the heel. The outsole really does pop, and when I wear these, which I will be doing very soon, I will be putting Drip Grip Soul Protectors on the bottom, the best soul protector on the market. As you guys can see, I have Drip Grip Soul Protectors on my Nike Off-White Dunks. It keeps the bottom in great condition. Make sure you guys cop your Drip Grip Soul Protectors. Link down below, and you're gonna use the code Danny10 to get 10% off your order. I love using Drip Grip Soul Protectors on the bottom of my expensive sneakers, especially with icy outsoles. It keeps the bottom in great condition, and I plan on putting Drip Grip on the reimagined Chicago Jordan 1s as soon as they come in, which I'm gonna try to get them early, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. If you guys get this video up to 600 likes, I will go cop the reimagined Chicago's early, but as soon as I get them, they're going straight to feet. I cannot wait and I know there's gonna be some resell on them. It won't be nearly as high as the trophy rooms. These are numbered, which is crazy limited, 12,000 pairs. These are extremely, extremely fire. The trophy rooms are fire, straight fire, and it's absolutely crazy to see the market tank to go from two grand all the way up to over three grand and tank down now to around 15, 1600. What the hell happened? Oh my goodness, this is crazy. And I'm sorry, guys. I got this one wrong. I messed up. I apologize. I truly am sorry. I'm not going to get every call right, but sometimes I'll get calls right. Sometimes I'll get calls wrong. It's a part of the sneaker game. It is based on my experience. I did think that these would remain hype, but the market has really tanked, and Jordan 1 hype has really tanked with that as well. So, hey. It is what it is. I'm sorry, guys. The Trophy Rooms are still a fire, straight fire sneaker. If you want them, hey, I think it's a good time to buy. They're at an all-time low, and it's a fire sneaker. Very limited, only 12,000 pairs. The details are there. Nike Air on the tongue. Michael Jordan signature on the heel. Chicago colorway, vintage midsole, icy outsole with the stars. These are fire, man. I absolutely love these, and I can't wait to rock them. I did pay $2,000 for these, so hey, I'm feeling it. I'm... You know, at a loss, if I were to sell them, I did buy them as a personal anyway. So I'm not too mad at it, but I know some people out there, man, spent a lot of money. And to see the market drop, it sucks, man. I'm sorry. Hey, I'm not going to get every call right. As long as I'm more right than I'm wrong, I think that's what truly matters. I appreciate you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you guys like this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Get your giveaway entries in for a free pair of the Reverse Mocha Travis Scott's. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you guys join the more family. Hit that subscribe button. Smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop. Always dropping that fire. Straight 
fire. Thank you guys so much for watching. We out.